Hello guys, thanks for joining me. Today I'm going to have a look at an item that I bought just a couple of days ago and it's a pocket knife. It's a so-called Swiss Army knife and I thought I'd treat myself to one of these for a EDC knife. And EDC stands for Everyday Carry. It means it's legal to carry around in the United Kingdom where I live. Um, it comes in a nice silver box it says victoria knox on the side here and what i bought is the hiker model which is appropriate for the activities that i do i do a lot of hiking that is the um, price that i paid for it as i say i live in the united kingdom um, if you're in the uh, states you'll probably um, pay that in dollars for the um, same knife anyhow made in switzerland says so on the side here so opening it up, you have the traditional red Swiss Army knife scales, plastic scales. It's quite a nice, um, handy knife. It isn't heavy. It only weighs about, I don't know, about two and a half ounces there, thereabouts. I don't know, about, um, what's that? That's about 70-something, 70 75 um, grams or thereabouts. It's three and a half inches long, and it's just under a inch deep so quite a useful knife just um, slip into your pocket slip into your rucksack take it with you as i say it's a um, legal knife here in the united kingdom so i can carry you with me when i'm going into town or shopping and things like that just um if i need it it is about the um, same size as my very first knife i ever had um, this is probably going to be my very last pocket knife that I'll ever buy. Um, I've got more than 20 knives at the moment, and I won't be needing any more, really. And this should last um, last me for the rest of my life, basically, and um, the rest of my hiking um, days. Um, I got this knife here when I was 12 years old. My father bought it when I went into the um, Boy Scouts, and I used it extensively until I was about 15 or 16. Um, it's, the belt loop is broken off, but... That's that. Anyhow, going back to this knife here, it's a um, slip joint um, pocket knife, which means it's a non-locking knife. The um, blades do not lock. The um, blades are made out of a, of a high carbon stainless steel. So let's have a look at the um, blades first of all. So you got two blades on it, um, a longer one, which is about two and a half inches in length, which is that one, and the um, shorter one and a half inch um, blade as you can see they're both spear point um, shape and as i say they're made out of a high carbon stainless steel which means that they won't stain or rust um, so that's a good thing however they don't keep an edge for very long so if you use them extensively they will get dull pretty quickly and you'll need to sharpen them on a more regular basis but that shouldn't be a problem at all i like the fact that there are two blades on it um, I can see myself using the smaller blade on a more um, on a day-to-day -day basis for cutting things up, and using the um, larger blade for more extensive work when I'm hiking or whatever. Um, and it means that you'll always have two um, blades, and one of them should always be sharp. Um, so what else about it? Um, I was under two minds about getting either the um, camper version or the hiker version. In the end, I chose the um, hiker version because of this feature here. It is a Phillips screw head, very useful when you're using a knife around the house. The camper version had a corkscrew, and in 40 years of hiking, I've never taken bottles of wine with me, so I couldn't see myself using the um, corkscrew. So I've chosen the um, hiker version instead with the um, Phillips head. There's a nice all as well um, so if you're doing repairs in the wild if you're doing leather work anything like that quite a useful feature to have and it is actually quite a useful feature i mean i've got one of my old boy scout knife and i've used it so many times that um, it actually is bent out of shape so it is a useful item to have um, when you're doing things there's a little hole on the um plastic um, scale here you could i suppose stick a um, knit a needle into it or something um, and i've seen people on the internet on reviews actually doing that um, don't think i'm going to do that but there's a tiny little hole here which you could sit a pin into if you wanted to for whatever reason the other functions are there are two openers um, this is the can opener 
it has a flat top uh, screwdriver head to it. There's also a notch for um, cutting or um, stripping wire. So again, useful for, um, I suppose, if, you, if you're attaching a plug or whatever um, to an appliance. Um, and the um, can opener also has a small, smaller size um, screwdriver head to it. So useful for um, opening cans if you're out on a, on a hiking trip or the like. And the other function is a very useful um, wood saw. So you can use it for cutting um, small branches and the like, um, whittling down wood, preparing fire, um, campfires or shelter making. Also cuts plastic, quite a nice feature to have. So I can see myself using that um, when I'm out hiking. Less useful, I think, for me will be the little plastic toothpick. Um, I don't see any reason. Um, I've been hiking for more than 40 years. I've never required a toothpick yet, but I suppose it's there if I ever do need one. And otherwise, we've got a very useful set of tweezers. So pulling out thorns or splinters and the like. So that's going to be a useful item to have. So as I say, it's a high carbon um, stainless steel blade. It has quite a short belly, it's quite a thin blade, um, nice uh, spear point shape to it though. And as I say, it's a slip joint, which means that it doesn't lock, so um, non-locking. If we compare it to the old Boy Scout knife, you can see the um, blade on my Boy Scout knife is a lot um, thicker. There's a more of a um, blade belly to it. Um, so, but I believe this is quite good steel. It should be nice and strong for um, everyday use if you're not going to overdo it. Um, so, as I say, I look forward to using the knife, taking it with me on future hikes. You may think, uh, what's the point of having a uh, screwdriver when you're out hiking? But um, for me, for example, I always carry a um, tripod with me and it'll be uh, useful for attaching the um, camera attachment to the um, tripod, um, tripod, I should say, um, so it's going to be useful for that um, regard. So quite a nice um, knife, as I say, um, it does come with instructions, there is a set of instructions in the box here. So that's it, a Victoria Knox Hiker model. So as always, I suppose, thanks for watching, and bye for now.